News, a Toronto police officer is now facing charges in the death of a 19 year old Brampton man. Chad Facey died in hospital back in April of 2021 after an interaction with a couple of constables who were off duty. Ontario's Special Investigations Unit announcing today that Constable Kelvin Au, an eight-year Toronto Police veteran who was working in 55 Division, has been charged with manslaughter and aggravated assault in the death of 19-year-old Chad Facey. The SIU would not divulge any further information about the case, but documents filed at a police tribunal last year revealed that Constables Au and Gurmak Benning were both off duty when they went to a Brampton neighborhood to meet Facey and buy an Apple Watch that was being advertised on Kijiji. According to the documents obtained by City News, after the transaction took place, the constables realized the watch was counterfeit and they drove in the direction of Facey, who was running away. Ow then allegedly got out of the car, chased him down and took him to the ground. The documents say there was a struggle and Ow tried to maintain physical control. Sometime later, when Facey's friends picked him up, he appeared unwell and was eventually taken to Brampton Civic Hospital, where he later died. The officers did not report that interaction. Their involvement was revealed four months later during appeal police investigation of Facey's cell phone records. That's when the SIU was notified. A lawyer representing Facey's family says they've been suffering endlessly for two years trying to understand what happened. His mother saying in a statement, it has been clear to our family that there was some kind of misconduct that had occurred in respect to Chad's death. We are happy to finally see the officer as being held accountable for his actions. Now, the tribunal proceedings were put on pause when the SIU began its criminal investigation. Toronto police tell me that once these charges were laid, Constable Au was immediately suspended. We're also told that internal investigations for both officers regarding police misconduct will continue once the criminal case wraps up in the courts. Now, Constable Au will be making his first court appearance in Brampton on March 2nd.